Hey guys and welcome to my review of the Ernie Ball Music Man Luke L3. This is uh, Steve Luca's newest signature model that's just recently came out. This is in the body blue finish and um, it's a real great paint job. Um, I'm not sure if you can see it clearly in the camera but it's got a great sparkle to it. Um, this has two Damasio transition pickups which are really great. Amazing tone. You have a five-way switch, volume and tone, and the Music Man trim, which is really great. You can see it flutters really nicely, um, which you can hear in some of the playing um, that I've done on this video. Um, it's got some nice uh, metal parts instead of plastic on the uh, five-way five -way switch and the uh, tremolo arm. It's, uh, you can pull the bar right out. There's no screwing system necessary. It fits in really nicely and snug there. So quite out again, because I've got it nice and tight on mine. And you can uh, change the tightness on the back here's in a little Allen key hole right there. The um, input jack's my favorite design. These just do not wear out. I mean, it's solid. No crackling or anything from this guitar. The rounding of the body, the, um, the smoothness and the way it's cut out is really beautiful. I mean, it's the most comfy guitar in the world to play. Um, you can see the design is really well thought. Uh, well thought out. And um, this particular model has the Ernie Ball Music Man strap locks, which I really love. The um, back here, you've got the controls underneath here um, for this great feature, which is your gain boost, which I really love on the push push volume pot. Um, but you can change the amount of gain you have in the back here, though I just kept it standard. I really love the way it sounds. There's the battery box for the power of that um, that system. And the the uh, the great thing about this, I just love the way the back plates feel. I'm not sure if they're metal, but they feel like metal and the screws are recessed, which is nice. Um, the all-access neck joint is amazing on these guitars. I mean, you've got a nice five-screw um, bolt-on neck to give you that really nice fatness in the tone. You get a lot more of the bass, I find, um, and a lot more of the tone from the neck comes through to the body. Uh, and also, I really like the way that they allowed more um, body and neck joint contact, if that makes sense, um, because it just resonates better. And also, we got a really good piece of rosewood for the fingerboard. You can see it's quite thick. Um, there is uh, a really beautiful bird's eye, roasted, roasted bird's eye maple neck here um, with the Charla, the Charla machine heads, which I really like um, these particular machine heads, with the Music Man compensated nuts. So you've got really great intonation everywhere and tuning stability. Um, the frets are kind of, I would say the medium low profile, um, medium as compared to the frets you get on Ibanez, and uh, your truss rod wheel is right here, so no neck uh, back plates or, or plates to unscrew or anything, you can access it very easily. Um, other features that I really love about the guitar is um, the oiled neck, so no lacquer, but you, you can see here there's a line where the headstock and uh, starts in the neck ends, um, there's the lacquer, but the neck itself is oiled, so it feels really nice, and it kind of warms up as you play it, it kind of conducts the heat from your hand. Um, and also, what I really love, love about this guitar is the weight. Um, it's a little bit bigger than the pre previous two Luke models. Um, it's a tiny bit heavier, but it's in a nice way. Um, it's very light, I mean, it's quite small, the, which I love because um, you don't bang it on anything because the headstock's smaller, the body's a little smaller. Um, you can get it on a plane easier because the case is smaller too. Um, the other thing I really love about this is the, the shape of the neck. You've got a V profile. It's kind of soft, but it's um, you can't really see the profile on the camera. You've got to try these guitars out really in person. Um, and the setup, the action was fantastic. I'm not sure if you can see that there, but nice low string action. Um, which I like on some guitars. Uh, other points that I really love about this is, it's a silly thing, but it's got L3 on the headstock um, instead of Luke. Now, I'm a huge fan of Steve Luca there, but when you have a guitar with someone's signature on it, you just feel, I don't know, you're playing 
their guitar. So it's nice to have a guitar that is a signature guitar, but it's not got the signature on it, if that makes sense. So it feels more like yours. So, uh, you know, if you're playing a show and someone sees that you've got a Music Man uh, Albert Lee guitar, they're just going to assume that you're going to play country music. Um, I guess uh, if, if people recognize this guitar, then, then they know that you're probably a fan of Steve Luca there. But, you know, it doesn't have the signature on the headstock. So I just like that silly thing. Um, the Music Man Trem is amazing. The stability and return to pitch is perfect. Uh, I have mine set a little bit further forwards so that I can pull it back. Um, I like to be able to pull it back uh, just to, you know, get those cool kind of Steve Luca, the Jeff Beck kind of sounds from it. Um, and I really love the radius in the fingerboard. It's fairly flat um, and it just feels really slinky. I've got nines on here, nines to 42s. Um, I sometimes use tens, but on this particular guitar, nines just feel perfect. And uh, that's it really. The, the five-way switch and, and the Damasio um, transitions just give you so many variations of tone. And uh, you'll notice when I'm pressing, you can see when I'm pressing this here, the push-pull volume, which is your gain boost on, on when I'm playing, that the gain is quite, you know, quite powerful. And um, all of the high gain sounds you're hearing on this video is from that, not from the amp. The amp's just on crunch and on clean. So this is doing all of the work. Um, so it's pretty amazing. <laughs>
I kind of made a point of playing lots of different things on this guitar for this video to show that this is, it really is the ultimate studio guitar. You can take this to any session, pretty much, and it will handle it really well. Um, it's just amazing. And the great thing about it, because it's so comfy to play, if you're doing session after session, uh, if you get one of those days where you've just got um, 12 or 13 different things to get down, get recorded down that day, and it's kind of maybe 10, 12 different styles or different things to play, um, you can play this all day. It's not going to tire you out, just designed for comfort, but it will handle all, all of the tones. If you've got a great amp, then you need a great guitar to go with it, and this is the one. So there you have it. This is the Ernie Ball Music Man Luke L3 guitar. You see one of these in the store, pick it up and play it. It's amazing.